Bro. Bring these mics closer. Jesus Christ. What are we saying? Yeah, fam. Art right, clips, so we back again in the building. SoundCloud edition. Yeah, this is the audio, guys. The cameraman, he's got a baby D. Hopefully, we pray Man, everything like, goes that. I swear, the first art clips in child, what are you saying? <laughs> big, up, big up Jermaine every time. Man said Ace, AC child, we could look it. <laughs> what were you, you telling me, BJ, from the the socials have been mad Bro, lately, fam? I don't know what's going on on Twitter, but everyone just moving. It's a mausoleum at the moment, to be honest. It's a mausoleum. Flipping. Let's even. Let's even break down because everyone knows there's been a madness going on. Nah, so let's go straight to the smoke. Let's not even play about it. No, no, no. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's, let's be fair. There's two main things. If you didn't know, you don't know. Riz Latif, Sherelle, and the, the infamous Wheel Up, followed by the fraudster that is Ghost Banks, Jason Christie. <laughs> What's going on? This is all in the space of how many days? Well, maybe like the last, let me see, four or five Bro, days. don't make no sense. But yeah, we we'll work with the. Should I? Do you want to go through the Riz Latif show? Yeah, yeah let's go sh- straight to the switch. Should bro. I explain it or do you not explain it? Yeah, well, no, nah, because yeah, you showed it to me first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. All right, cool. So, for our lovely listeners out here, um, it was Boiler Room. What day was the Boiler Room? It was. I feel like it was over the. Wait. No, it wasn't the weekend, was it? I'm not sure. Anyway. The most recent Boiler Room had um, Sherelle, Riz Latif, uh, Josie Mitsu. I can't remember anyone else. If I missed you out, sorry. Yeah, sorry. But yeah, um, yeah, it was kind of a mad set. It was Sherelle's set. She was going crazy, spazzing. It was just fully jungle, I swear. That she was playing. Yeah, no, nah, she was playing. She was just going on a mother. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, man. so she was spinning, doing a mad thing. And then Riz Latif came over, wheeled one of the tunes. You know, a typical boiler room style, just yeah, yeah, really yeah. one of the tunes. And then, obviously, she, she was a bit shocked, so she's looking at man like, whoa, but, you know, they're yeah, G's the, anyway. The, so the first show expression was a bit mad still, yeah. I can't even laugh. However, <laughs> he then got onto Twitter, and then Twitter decided, you know, mad. to cancel him, because mm. in the words of some some people, I'm not going to name no names today, car. I can't lie, thing pisses me off, but... Um, <laughs> We don't want to get cancelled himself. No, 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 I don't care about getting fucking cancelled in because it's actually bullshit. Bro, it's, not, it's not safe for help. I bro, swear, bro. bro, don't cancel DJ Jazz, man. I'm just trying to live my life, trying to do my thing. But yeah, so um, apparently that wheel up um, was a, what, what, was, what was the description? It took away from her shine, it's the way men take away from women's shine in day-to-day life mm. because, you know, in quote-unquote, Boiler Room is not a night out it's a, um, what, what, it, it's not a night out. It's a showcase. It's a showcase it's a, of your skills. Mm. So, the wheel up was seen to be disrespectful by some people and seen to be wrong. Mas- a wheel up. It's a madness. A it's wheel a madness. up. And these are people yeah. that are, 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 are then, um, what, how can I say? Of are, the culture. They're not of the culture. Mm. And they're telling us, some, do you know what it is? Mm. My, this is? I'll tell you, yeah, and it's my issue with, I don't even think I've explained this properly, but my issue with a lot of people in general is that people not of the culture are telling people mm. in the culture how to run their, how to live in their culture. Mm, 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 mm. At the end of the day, if you really understand what, you know, underground music is, so I'm talking about Grime, Garage, um, what's his name, Drum and Bass, Jungle, yeah, um, yeah uh, Dancehall, you know, yeah, all yeah, these yeah. kind of music. Uh, Wheel Ups have been in, yeah, what's his name? it's been systemic in it. Um, since the sting. Since the start, bruv. Wheel ups have been, bro. Go to any black rave, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm gonna say, you know, hip hop, R and B, bashment rave. Mm, I even mm, went to one on Saturday. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? When the DJ is saying, when the MC is saying, pull up, reload it, fam. Bro, you're not talking about a gun, fam. You're talking about play the tune again. That's the what the wheel is. Yeah. So for you to then tell me that the wheel is disrespectful, it doesn't make sense. <laughs> doesn't make sense. It's really, I'm, I'm, and it pisses me off here because I'm gonna have my rant now. It pisses me <laughs> off because you're, you're taking away. Um, what's the name? You're taking away merit from actual issues within mm. the industry that women have to go through, yeah, that people yeah, of colour yeah. have to go through. Do you know what I'm saying? There's the different hoops they have to jump through. You're cheapening that struggle by telling people that they can't wheel. It doesn't make sense. It's a wheel. You know, yeah, Denzel talking it. Yeah, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me play devil's advocate. I'll play it, it and I'll suck the let shit me, out Let you. me play Mother devil's fuck. advocate. Yeah, so let me drink my drink in it. I, I, didn't, I didn't see it when you were saw it in it, but when I watched the video, like, so I'm, I'm looking at it from Cheryl's video, so like, she's playing the tune, the tune's 
banging vibes, yeah. like footwork, high tempo. And I can't lie, okay, from a DJ's point of view, it's that it's that point here yeah, where it's 50-50. You could wheel it up, but the energy is so sick that, nah, let's let it, let's let it, let it vibe for let a little build. bit more in it. Let, let's let it build. But then Rizla Tifu, I've got nothing against, but he kind of comes out the background. Yeah, but like, yeah, but like, yeah, but like, no, but but what you need to remember is that he's not, Mm. he's not an any guy. It's not like I did it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -mm -mm. She don't know me from Adam. Mm -mm -mm. Like they're G's, they're friends. Oh, so they know each other. They're friends. Mm -mm -mm. And the reason it's another thing that people saw that clip. Mm. Yeah, and this is what people like to know on Twitter as well. It's, I call it fake outrage. They saw mm. the clip, they ran, they ran with the clip because they didn't even know the person that even put it up first chopped it in a way. Because if you go yeah. look uh, and if you look five minutes after, yeah, you see them bless it. Oh, you see them. You see like them hug spud. it out and yeah. spud five yeah, seconds no. after he did it. So he willed it. She had mm. the look. She played it again. She left the deck yeah, to go yeah, and yeah. find him. She yeah. found him. You see them embrace. You see them go, it's cool. She yeah. didn't even say it's fine. He even apologized. She said it's fine. But then people are cancelling the guy because he willed the tune. Mm-mm-mm. You know what I mean? It don't make sense. Like I'm not saying like I'm not saying you have rights to go to other people's sets and do it. Don't get twisted. Yeah. Go to a Marcus Nasty set and wheel his tune. Yeah, you get boxed in the face. Bow. I said bow. <laughs> bow, <laughs> bow. Just holding bows, man. <laughs> but like you can't in the same, you know what I'm saying? Like, people I think took it out of context in a mm. sense and also or outraged, like them trying to make it a thing of it's taken away from the shine of a female DJ. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. At the end of the day, what is really, really sad is, I think personally, from my point of view, that's probably the sickest set I've seen at Boiler Room yeah, in no, the last looked, how many years? It looked lit. I can't even like. like she had that. Lit. Remember? Have you heard that? You know that remix that every that's just gone everywhere that she played. Yeah, you like, I saw her at, um keep hush like. A couple like, weeks ago, yeah, bro. Yeah, that went off as well. Fam, she's sick. With her and Fozia did a back to back, bro, bro, energy. Bro, 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 bro. And the thing is, I'm sure like other people are wheeling up her let tunes me, there as well. Let me tell you something but... funny. Let me tell you something <laughs> fucking hilarious in it. That's why people don't know they don't do their research. So she apparently mm. did the same thing to Logan Sama the Saturday beforehand. Mm, mm, mm. Like literally wheeled Logan Sama's tune Saturday beforehand. It's not an issue. You know what I'm saying yeah. because. It's seen, like, if you don't, like, within, like, DJing and, like, this kind of music, if someone, um, what's name, feels like, yeah, let me, let me jump over and will your tune. Yeah. It's actually seen as a compliment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, if I'm playing a set, yeah, don't get twisted, obviously, there's any reason. If I'm playing a set, you're wheeling every four tunes, I'm going to slap you. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, like, if I'm doing a set and you feel, yeah, like, bruv, what the, what, bruv? Yeah, yeah. People in the culture know it's, like, a sign of respect. It's a sign of it's respect, like, you know what I'm saying? That like, tune is sick, that man. Tune you, is gotta, hard. you gotta replay it basically. Play it again. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But the issue is a lot of people taking it as a as offensive. And it's mm. it's sad because like funny there's a tweet I saw that really sums this up here. There are people still in the industry mm-hmm. that are, you know what I'm saying, they've done madnesses, they rape, they've done they've yeah, done madnesses, sexual assault, sexual, assault, sexual, assault, sexual mm. harassment, them kind of things. But they're 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 fine in the scene. Mm. But you wanna cancel someone that wield a tune and furthermore, like he, what I think is what what I respect about him mainly is like how authentic he is as an as a DJ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if you don't know, the guy only plays on vinyl. Yeah, when he man. plays shows and stuff on radio, he only does vinyl. I've seen him he play. He presses does vinyl, thing, it? bro. Do you yeah, know how hard yeah. it is to go and mm. press vinyl? I I don't know where you go to press vinyl, yeah, bro. And the grime he plays, it, bro. It's dub next plates. Level. He did a full dub plate. Uh, what's his name? Dub plate set. Mm. Again, if you don't know what dub plates are, the exclusive tunes mm. usually. Tunes that you can't find anywhere else, so like one of a kind tunes. So you can only hear the tunes if you go to his set, which is authentic underground DJing. But yeah. again, people want to take away from that and just be like, oh, well, he should have not, da, 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 he's taking a shine from her. No, you're taking a shine from her because no one realized he did it. Yeah, yeah. Nice. I didn't know he did it. All I saw from Twitter was Sherelle mm. when she went, um, when she played that. Do you know R.I.P. Groove remix? Do you know there's a jungle remix that she played? I'm that, sure, I'm it's sure like a I've clip. It's like the main clip mm. boiler room I've been using. Mm. Bruv, that's what I, that's all I saw. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. didn't see no one jacking no tunes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But again, people just want to be outraged about something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You we, don't we, understand we, the coach. Get in, out. We live in the outrage era, man, to be it's honest. too much, man. Oh, I've taken my hat off. <laughs> I'm sweating. Oh. But I feel like what we have to analyse is like, okay, like, we in the scene have seen that. Like, mm. we know, like, it's not that big, in it? So... My thing is like I understand why people outside the culture don't yeah, get it, but I get it. How, how are people who are like DJs as well, like yeah? But then just, again, again, like I hear that part. 
that's what I feel like is education. You need to, as someone that's, you want, if you want to be in this scene, educate mm. yourself. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, same way, I can't go, like, I'll give an example, in, like, techno music and house mm. music and stuff like that. It's kind of like a, the way, um like, the sets are built is more of, like, a whole, like, whole amalgamation of tunes. Yeah. It's not one song by another song. You're mixing and blending. Realistically, when you hear a set, you're not going to hear those songs again, kind of mm. thing, because then kind of, you're building music. So you don't will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So oh, yeah, I, I get what you're saying. It's like you're telling a story kind of thing. Exactly. Yeah. But you don't you, but you don't wheel in those aspects. Yeah. And so but so if I then go into that scene yeah, yeah, yeah. and start wheeling tunes left, right and centre. Yeah, it's a bit mad. And yeah. then start telling people, What do you mean I can't mm. do it? How you don't know what you're talking about? No, mm. you don't know what you're talking about. You haven't gone and you haven't done your research. At the end of the day, it's not disrespectful what my man did. And the fact that he even felt that he had to deactivate his Twitter. It's yeah, actually the mad. saddest thing for me. And the thing is, like, what the saddest, saddest, saddest thing is, a lot of people, these same people will talk about mental health in music. Yeah. yeah. Something I actually want to touch on. Mental health in music. But then those same people then drag a guy for doing something that's as innocuous as, um, what's his name, P- putting a tune. What makes it so much worse is that he was on Twitter, like, feeling so shit about his set because, yeah. like, people were, you know, Boiler Room, like, you know how Boiler Room comments yeah, are like, yeah, yeah. oh, you can't mix. and you know, Some people don't care about it. Some people, they they, they feel it. He yeah. was feeling it. So imagine you're feeling it, recovering from that, and then bang, yeah, you, you get, get slammed you again. You get dragged again. You get dragged. You know what I'm saying? You get dragged for all sorts. And it's bad. So, like, honestly, I think the situation's done. Everyone understands it. If you don't understand yeah. it, just leave the scene. I don't really care. Like, no, it's, it's... it doesn't make sense what you're, what you're talking about. I think if you look at it from like a super PC sensitive lens, then yeah, you could see it's a <laughs> bit, it's a disrespect in it. To what? <laughs> to fuck off, man. <laughs> yeah, that's PC in it. No, I'm saying like if you're like, oh, like this guy's just come out of nowhere. He's yeah, but like quote unquote interrupted oh, her. That's <laughs> quote, not interrupted her. That's set. not interrupting though. But wait, okay, so if it wasn't that deep, why did Sherelle make that facial expression? Because she was shocked, there? that's it. Same way, it's, happened, that, to, it's that, happened that, to... That facial expression was an expression no, of, wow, like, no, God no, crap, you just now touched you're, up now, my Now you're... Now, 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 you're being disingenuous now. <laughs> now you're being disingenuous. She did not... She just made the... That's just a typical black... You know, like, nah, but wait, it. if she rated it, wouldn't she be like... No, because she saw it. No, because, mm. okay, first, yeah, so it happened. She was yeah. shocked. She was looking for who did it. Yeah. Okay. Because at the end of the day, if I have a set yeah, and it gets yeah. wheeled when I'm not looking, I'll be like, okay, who did it? You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. If I then see it's my G, I'm like, cool. Yeah. If I see it's I don't know, um an acquaintance. Someone I don't someone I don't like. Yeah. Then there's a thing. That's what she I'm looked sa- for him, <laughs> then she said it's cool. Mm, mm, mm. It's also because it was a dead wheel. Don't get twisted yeah. that she had that face. Cause he yeah. didn't really wheel it properly. Mm, mm, it was mm, like mm. a you know them dead wheel where you don't really you oh, don't really yeah. get the drrr, you just get the it didn't really make sense, in it? You didn't really get the that that bird. I call it the bird call. I said the bird call. The bird call. Drrr, I said that's the, the Cardi B call. One. The Cardi B. <laughs> but like, like he didn't mean like he I, didn't mean that as a disrespect. Do you know what I'm saying? And yeah, they yeah, had yeah. they they were cool. If she yeah. came out on Twitter and they said I didn't like it, then cool. Yeah. At the end of the day, then he has to get take away. He has to take yeah. it because she didn't fuck with it. Yeah. Bro, she ain't got a problem with it. Why you got a problem with it? Yeah, Why you got a yeah. problem with something that no one else got a problem with? Put yourself in the bin, man. I'm pissed <laughs> off with some of these people. Fuck. People just want to have problems these days, isn't it? But yeah. there's, there's I hope, basically I hope my man's good though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Bottom line, in it, like yeah. if someone like you never know what a man's dealing with. So if you're out there just tearing him down because because of that clip, that's a that bit of a sense. madness. Because you never know, he could mm. he could be going through it. Yeah, like, yeah, you know, yeah, his Personal life. And if and he's, he's deactivated his tour, that shows that, that shows he's, like, he says yeah, a lot. Yeah. Because even I think <laughs> Spooky said one mm. funny tweet. Yeah, he's like. Cause I don't know why my man, not in a rude way. Like, I don't mm. know why he um, deactivated his tweet. If it was me, I would have just used yeah. that promo. I was scheme trust. Drop a tune and <laughs> I swear, day. I swear. I would have just dropped a mix. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry in it, but bro, these times, like, traffic on your feet, bro. You, you got know. everyone's looking. Everyone's typing your name, bro. Yeah, bro Adam, yeah. Treat me mix. I'm playing in this this place next week. Well, you might as well use it. Still. You know what I'm saying, but you know, big up, big up here anyway. Like, I don't think it's an issue, and I feel like if you can take any way from take anything away. Just learn mm. the culture you want to be involved in. Don't, don't you know, feel like you can you, know, you can step in somewhere and just because bro, like wheeling has been happening before any of us were born. Um, bro, it's been happening from um, sound system days yeah, in, Jamaica yeah, in Jamaica with yeah, reggae yeah, music. That's where it I came mean, from. 
That's yeah. where it came from. So it's gone yeah. through there. It's come down into reggae. It's gone down into dancehall. Mm. It's coming to jungle. It's coming to grime. Yeah. It's not a new thing. It's not a thing that we started yesterday. Mm-hmm. So you mm-hmm. can't start telling people when to do it or when not to do it. Yeah, especially when that tune, it, it did have high energy. So it Bro. was like, it did permit and a wheel up, in my opinion. Why do people are argue with mm. plastician, bruv? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So bro, his name's not even plastician, bruv. That's plastic, man. That's, 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 that's a grand legend. That's plastic, yeah. man. You're telling oh, X, Y, and Z to you. Well, we need to have a res- due to respect to the scene, but at the end of the day, that's just music, isn't it? Yeah, but yeah, yeah. It's funny, though, I can't lie. No, no, it was... It's funny. It was, but, it was funny still. But you know, at least, you know, my man wasn't finessing people out of... Um, <laughs> no, when you saw him without ghost banks, too. Oh, my God. Bro, bro, explain the ghost bank situation, please. Um, so I'm seeing... He's just posing as bare things. He, he's a he's a chameleon. I'll call him. Bro, he's, he's a, a four one nine chameleon. That's bro, that's bro, how I'll call him. But I've seen him on Twitter before, like bears. But I just thought this guy's just like bait. Mm, yeah, yeah. Can't just do an F. Yeah, no. I've seen I've seen his name about as well. So apparently he was a uh, he's so he's 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 got he's a multifaceted guy. So he's a A and R for GRM. <laughs> No, he's not. <laughs> he's not though. No, he's not. He's not. Bro, he's a, 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 no, he's a, a, not. not. A, a, GRM Saber said he's not. GRM Daily said he's not. Nah, nah, yeah, I'm taking a piss. In it. This guy. Um, uh, he's a. Uh, okay, okay. We'll, we'll say he. You know what? He posed as he an posed, A&R for we'll GRM because GRM when I when when I said this stuff, <laughs> let me get the tweet off in it. But yeah, continue, continue. He's. He works for Spotify, but then <laughs> the maddest thing I saw was the the branding packaging he was offering, oh which was a peas for obviously getting your songs on radio playlists, getting your songs on Spotify, like getting you in, you in touch with record labels. He 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 apparently do the service, but for for bags basically. <laughs> that. I'm thinking if I saw that and I didn't know you, I'll be like, nah, fam, what? bro. Let me what see if I can hell? find. I need to find the um the initial tweet where they were like, "Don't send this guy bread again." Oh yeah, no, it um, was um the was editor rap. Yeah, and cool. Scriffin. Young, okay, I'll I'll, re, I'll I'll repeat it. Young hungry artist, do not give your money to ghost banks. He's a total fraud, and I've now found out several occasions where he has stolen money. He has posed as a GRM A and R before. See, I told you he wasn't GRM. Yeah, yeah. He has yeah, posted yeah. the G- GRM. <laughs> A and R before, and is currently pretending to work for Spotify, and then he's ta- he, the guy tagged Austin Darbo. Yeah, yeah, no. Nah, if Austin Darbo sees that, it's smoke for him. Oh, the smoke! It's oh, smoke. smoke! He's pissed. That's why the guy was like, "Oh," because I've seen Austin Darbo on Twitter. Fam. He's he's quick and he's not happy. But he was not happy when it happened. And he works, um, pretends to work for Spotify, and proposing fake marketing campaigns that people yeah. are paying th- thousands for. Oh, do not dude. give your money to him he will take it and appropriate <laughs> and appropriately ghost and you won't hear from him again fam, the name fits though the name fits ghost what? bank so yeah but like fam well if you actually deeper the name fits yeah, but, he, but like the guy's been, money but yeah, and he's been doing ghosting. it for time so yeah yeah no nah, like it's I can't lie it's good that um Alex Griffin shouted that out cause I think they were just it was probably getting to a point where cause they were probably just getting a lot of people saying ah oh, like, where's my tune? I'm trying to get hold of Ghost Banks. And, and the thing is, like, you know, the, the deeper thing it shows, it shows how, like, first of all, we're trusting as a people. And Yeah, but, and, you, yeah, but when you see the guy's mm, profile, he mm, looks legit. He yeah, looks, yeah, leg- yeah, yeah, he looks yeah. legit, man. And it shows you as well how, like, artists, they want to get on in it. That's, that's their main aim often. So, like, if they see someone who they think, oh, this guy can help me get to the next level, they'll be over-trusting. So, first of all, that's that's my advice. Don't be over-trusting. Obviously, always tread carefully when you're getting involved with someone for the first time, innit? Yeah. Fair enough, if that's your G or you've seen this person with that person with that person so he's got a good track record, then there's an argument to say, yeah, you know what? I can pay this guy and he'll do this. But then... If he's got a profile, but you haven't really seen him do any work for anyone else, and then he comes to you, that's it's a bit hazy it's in my madness. opinion. Oh, it's a madness! But yeah. the the video yeah. thing just topped it off for me. Fam, oh, he, he um, mocked that guy. Yeah, 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 that was an app. Fam, how come man come down from North yeah, 
No, you came, you came, you came from Wolves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From Wolves down oh, to... Oh, I thought you came from Manny. You did not come from Manny. Well, I knew you went uni in Wolves. Anyway, yeah, he came up yeah, from no, Manny. Yeah, no, so I think he's from Manny, but yeah, his accommodation yeah. was in Wolves. Wolves. Yeah, yeah, No, no that guy, I swear that guy's from London even. I just, anyway, mm. he's come from Manchester down yeah. to London, Houston. Mm. The, they're now looking for a cameraman. Yeah. Even though he, they've paid the people. Wait, so who was, was the... The ghost banks, he was the connect between... Yeah, so he was the one saying, oh, yeah, yeah. like, we'll come shoot the music video, come yeah. do everything for you, blah, 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 blah. Send me the P, come down to London. Cool. Yeah. So the guys then come down to London and then they haven't found the cameraman till about 8 o'clock. Yeah, yeah. These times she's trained back to Wolves, was that like 10? 10, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the yeah. guy was even like, bruv, like, like, this is long, I want mm. to go home. The guy's like, no, no, don't worry, I got you in it. I'll bust your Uber. Fam, this guy sounds like the Wolves. King Finesse, bro. King 419. You know how much a cab <laughs> from London to... Anyway, he said it would eat it. No, he said he was going from... Be- he said London no, no. to Luton. Yeah, but obviously yeah. when they got to London, and the guy's mm. like, it's getting late. Yeah, like, yeah. He's getting a train back. Like, Don't worry, I'll get your Uber back to Wolves. To Wolves, yeah, yeah, yeah. From yeah, London. Yeah. Yigba, Jesu. <laughs> so what kind of Uber that is, bro? And obviously, <laughs> you know, it's time for Uber man to come, so... They then got the cameraman from Luton. Mm. It's obviously the guy. Yeah, the guy. Basically, the guys then. La- sorry, the guys. I'll start again. The guys landed from Manny, come down to London. They've met Ghost Banks. They're now looking for a cameraman. Finally got the cameraman at like eight thirty in Luton mm. from Luton. So they got the guy from Luton to come down. Yeah. Uh, they then recorded this music video. This this guy that's getting his video done for him is then in the car. Sit next to one brother, like yo, yeah, like well gone. He said, "Oh, how long have you known Ghost Banks for?" He's like, "Bro, yeah. I met him today, fam." He, he said, "I should." He said, <laughs> he Man, just, met the Donny on the day. He's like, "Yeah, I met Ghost Banks." Was like, "Fam, I got this G I've known for yeah, years. years." This is my brother. That's my fam. day one. What? This is my day one, bro. We had to church together. We used to ride out on the same strip. And obviously, my man he said, oh, "I met him today. Still, he wants to use my house, but he might need to move quick though." That's what the guy was saying. Like, you need to yeah. hurry up because it's my yard. So then. Uh, phew, it gets to about they say I don't know ten I got t- anyway it's too late for my man to yeah. go back to Wolves by train. He's then, uh, what do you call it? He's now in the you know wait for the Uber. Yeah, Just take them back to take him back to Wolves. Uber comes. Shit, I hey. cool. Uber's now come. Mm. He's thinking, all right, this guy's patterned. Yeah. So, but the Uber needs to go through Luton first. They get to Luton. Cabman's like, get out. Cab cab's um, cab has been cancelled. Yeah. So obviously the deed has just failed. The D has failed. This so guy, oh. he's in Luton now. Imagine you're in Luton. Yeah, you're quay. You're, you're out of the quay. ends. And you need to go. So the, car- the caravan just dipped off like, yeah, this ain't my problem. I'm in Luton. I'm yeah, going home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're stuck with the guy in the train station. 2, 2 a.m. 2 a.m. The guy's then calling up girls like, yo, send me some pee. Send me some pee. Send me some pee. Send me some pee. The girls, obviously, that's not that's not working. So man has to wait till 7 a.m. for the first train. Firm. Full, full on mockery. Like what, this, I think what mockery this, is this like, guy needs to be outed, and out I, of the scene. And I, and I think yeah, the music video didn't even come out in the end. It might. I think he. he I think he might have linked it into. I don't think it even came out in the end. I genuinely probably think, not. Like after all that madness, I wouldn't even want the video after all that madness. <laughs> might like, as well, fam. I'll be like, you, you did me that dirty, you like fucking dickhead. <laughs> nah, he actually mocked it, like. But I'm surprised that I don't know if if that um is it slits if you didn't chat about it before but yeah but obviously like with these things yeah you just don't wanna, mm. you don't want to make it seem a thick, like obviously with the industry oh yeah, yeah and yeah. if you talk too much you get to be honest I do the same thing as well because I'm like oh like sometimes I don't know if maybe the person's had a bad day they mess me around in it exactly. so. you don't want people to be like oh you never know like it's normal mm. like he's normally calm yeah 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 exactly. Then nah, nah, this guy's got a track record, man. Fraud, fraud, fraud. <laughs> this, guy, this guy's got a track, track record of just well, Big up, big up my man, F-Star. F-Star United. Dickhead. Yeah, he, but... taking... he did the same thing to Adrian from Backchat. Mm. He charged him like £700 for a promo campaign. Didn't see shit. Where, oh my days, where are these guys getting this money from? That's bro, bro, people work nine to fives, you know, so they can pay their, for their mm-hmm. dreams. And then people are coming out and taking the piss. That's what pisses me off, innit? Like, yeah, yeah, no, nah, you're messing around with people's, people's dreams. dreams. Yeah, it's not, yeah, yeah, like, it's not like this is, and, bro. And, uh, you could do this to people at work; they wouldn't really mm. give a shit. But like, if people actually, this is their dream. Like, they want to be an artist or whatever. Or well, there's out. people who ain't even like 
they're artists. They ain't even got a nine to five. So yeah, the bro, little money they, money they get, they have, yeah, exactly. Is what they're just all putting it into their is music. Is what you're using to just take the. Mm. Honestly, bro, if, if you're hearing this in it, fuck you. No, Big man. Who, car, you're a dickhead still. Hopefully it gets out here. Because me, 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 I don't really care about F mm. like that, innit? But like, when well, you're actually just, you're just stealing from people, innit? Yeah, that, yeah, like, yeah. Uh, their little money. They could, they, for you know, they, they could just be working in a takeaway or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what, let's say seven fifty an hour, mm. they have to fucking save. They have to put shifts in. I know people that, you know, that are rappers that they put shifts in. Yeah, yeah, You know what I'm yeah. saying? Doing, doing um, retail. And any money they have, yeah, is to make, you know, is to make music that they love to do. And you're just out here fucking finessing. But you're a fucking cunt. No, he needs to get out of the scene. But get out, man. Like, do, do, go and do one, innit? I can't even lie. Bro, bro, and I hope, I hope, I hope, apparently, yeah, there's one road mm. man that's onto him still. <laughs> yeah, I saw Fam, if he's messed around with a road man, bro, of course he has. This is his music. He's Fam, definitely messing around. It might be over for him, bro. One F star, you fucking idiot. You have to catch a quick flag I swear. to Must wherever he's originally from. I'm going to do it for the thing still. I'm going to slap my lap still. <laughs> fam, if someone, fam, if someone finesse me like that, I can't lie. I might have to get political still. That amount of money, <laughs> fire. Shit. But yeah, fam. Well, also, another madness. I, I put it in the group yesterday. The uh, which one do you? The AJ Tracy. Oh my god. <laughs> but yeah, let me break down the situation. <sighs> so AJ Tracy. He just, he released um, his debut album, self-titled AJ Tracy, um, last Friday, which I think is I like it in it. But what the album? Yeah, yeah I haven't yeah. listened to it. You yeah. haven't listened to it. Yeah, but for his so I'd say it's quite a polarizing album. I um, find he's good. Like people are fucking with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got that country song as well, which is yeah, sounds yeah, sick. bang still. He's got the tune of gigs, gigs, nothing but net, which lit. Like he's he's got. He's got tunes on there, but like the song in question is Psych Out, which that song was polarizing when it first came out because it's like it's got that Atlanta oh, that kind of trap vibe in it. And then even in the video, he's in like that famous Atlanta strip club magic. And like, I can't, the videos are madness, isn't it? It's mm, bare beauty. Of course you like it. Just <laughs> nyash, in it? You dirty bastard. <laughs> yeah, nyash, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, I, was, I was enjoying I I said, I enjoying the hands. <laughs> Jiggle, jiggle. But yeah, so like, yeah, he's on, um, I think it's BBC News with um, Victoria Some, Derby yeah, show. what is that thing, by the way, that, that show? Because I see it all the time. I don't know what it, what, is, is it, what BBC is it on? Fam, I don't watch TV anymore. Some it? Rebo BBC in it, one of them yeah. Rebo ones. But yeah, yeah, so it's Victoria Derby show. And like, she's just getting on to me, like, hard. Like, first she's like, about that psych out video. She's like, oh, would your mum like it? Rock, can which you is say dis- that? disrespectful in the first place, but then he's like, nah, like. But when, but when, but when Ozzy Osbourne was mm. biting um the heads off of of birds in it, man never said, man never said, would your mom like that in it? But Trust cool, me, bro. Say nay. Well, I'll you. say yeah, off off top in it, uh, this happens a lot with black music. Happens all, like, all the time. All the time, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Every yeah. time. So after that, yeah, she's like, ah, uh, um, with all these strippers in the, in this video, like the. In your other videos, do you ever show women in power? And he's like, he's just like, he's standing up for himself. He's like, my aim in this video was not to put women down, in it? Like, he just basically explained in, in Atlanta, that's their culture. <laughs> that's how they do their thing, innit? Mm. And then, but the nail in the coffin was, <laughs> she just said, oh, like, I see you with your videos. Gang members. Yeah, you got your gang that members That was around ridiculous. Like, that's like, his the, G's. Think about even the last couple of videos bro, apart he, from bro, the side. AJ, AJ Tracy has never had gang members in it. Like he, he, AJ Tracy, out of anyone, anyone you see in this video more yeah. time is people you actually just call him. You can yeah, just yeah, tell. Yeah. But obviously when it's, I don't care, but when it's black people mm. in music videos, straight gang. Same way when it's black people walking down this road, it's straight gang. Yeah, 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 How can yeah. you say that, bro? Gang members. More time, Hell that's actually his brothers, you know. Hell like his stereotypical. actual blood brothers are in his music videos more time. Or his cousins. Yeah, I'm saying, yeah, or people yeah. he's known from, like his friends, and you're then turning around and making it a gang gang issue, and like it, it, makes, it makes me sick. To be fair, yeah, man, it was hell, hella stereotypical. I was just like, bro, like, but I don't know why these rappers go on these shows though. Yeah, that that's what I thought as well. Like, why are you even? What, what, you, what, you, what can they do? The thing is, you? AJ Tracy he doesn't even do interviews that tough. So bro, he never does interviews. I can't lie, yeah, this mm. one thing for rappers as well. Mm. You need to hear this. If you want people to actually. Give you a good interview about your album. You need to mm. get p- 
people that understand what you do. Yeah. Stop going on these platforms mm-hmm. like BBC, like I'm talking about BBC, that like, all they've seen is um, drill is this and yeah, grime yeah. is that. Stop going on these shows. Fam, they probably think drill and grime are the, the, same same, thing. the same genre. Gr- same drill, music. grime, but you need to stop going on these channels because at the moment, what the issue is, is they won't go, they won't go on, I don't know, what can I say? They won't go on a interview with, like if GRM are doing, I swear, like, like, like look, how can AJ Tracy has mm. never done interviews, first interviews for BBC, mm. that, um, did it, um, you don't know her, you never watched her shit, but mm. your marketing team probably told you, yeah, it's a, it's good a look. big look in it, basically. Good look yeah. for who? Bruv, these places, they ain't got nothing for you. All they want to mm-hmm. do is tear you down. Do you know what I'm saying? So you don't need to be like, oh, I need to go on a BBC. I need to go. Bruv, I've never, you know, I've never, I don't know who what this woman does in it. I thought it was like some TV, I thought it was a BBC like program. I, oh, I, yeah, yeah. New, I've, I've never seen this. All, I've heard the name, I've heard the name. I've but, seen it, but I'm just mm-hmm. like, I've never, I never knew what she actually did. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But like, she was moving mad. But I would say though, for AJ, big up you in it because he handled it so well. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. could have gone left. Thank you so. Nah, he went. He went well. But he made yeah, her look stupid. Yeah, yeah. He made. He made her look because you know the guy. He's a very articulate guy. AJ yeah, Tracy. Yeah. So he made her look here yeah, like she was fishing yeah, for, for yeah, war yeah. in it. So I was just like. Oh. And the thing is, yeah, a lot of other rappers they would have. They would, they would have been like, nah, nah, oh, oh, no, no, oh, no, and they would start lying. Yeah. He was yeah. like, no, it's Atlanta culture. Everything he said was right. Yeah, yeah, yeah Go to Atlanta. Yeah, yeah. That is the culture, man. Yeah, yeah, yes yeah. and Nash and trap. In, 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 yes and trap. That is Atlanta. So what he said was not a lie. But like, I feel like, like with all these platforms, like you need to go on places where they will understand your music. Mm. You can't go same way. You know, I don't know. GRM wouldn't wouldn't interview uh, Marilyn Manson. Yeah. Because bro, they what are we gonna talk about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't yeah, they yeah. don't understand it. They don't uh must say the BBC won't understand what you're doing. All they're gonna do is try to tear you down. They're probably trying to make it oh yeah, we got another Joe artist on here. Let's rip him to shreds. Fam, I can't lie, it's, it's become a common pattern with them. Like, like what's this got to do? What is what, 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 that has nothing to do with he's he's coming on here to talk about his album. You're coming on it, you're talking about um gang members in his music video. Mm, but like like you said, I'm thinking from his point of view, like when you got the call up for the interview, what did you think you were gonna talk about with this this woman who like definitely manage, don't manage understand bro, the what scene? What are you doing, bro? I don't understand that one. That one though, didn't, make, mm. didn't make sense. Didn't make sense to me. Yeah, nah. It was it was kind of shocking to see. Just, I get what he's doing because mm. he's trying to push it to a wider audience, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. You can do it in other ways. Trust me, these people have nothing for you. But he, there's people in our scene who could definitely. Like your Tim Westwood, Charlie Smith. Yeah, Smurfs. look at Tim, Tim mm. Westwood. Did, I mean, actually, that's even a good mm. one. Tim Westwood, with uh, he did an interview with Fredo. Oh, yeah. And I they were talking that, about, you know? they were talking about like touchy subjects, you know what I'm mm-hmm. saying, about his previous life and what he oh, used yeah, to do yeah. and the crossover and all them things there. The way Tim Westwood did it was so articulate and yeah. so respectful of mm-hmm. Fredo, in it. He was like, yeah, you know what? Like, he, did, he didn't bait, he didn't want to bait out anything. Oh, yeah. yeah. To incriminate because he he understands the culture. Bro, yeah, yeah. Do, do, uh, go, if Fredo went on BBC, they'd be like, okay, so back in the day when you used to do X, Y, and Z, um, what makes you think it's okay for you to do, um, to make music now? Is your music talking about this? Um, da, 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 like incriminating yeah, yeah, yeah. him, do you know what I mean? So, yeah. I've, man, I just don't Basically, know. Basically, the moral of the story is go away, you're appreciated. Isn't it? And like, understood. I understood. Mainly understood than appreciated because these people have nothing for you. Yeah. Like, bruv, what she, I couldn't believe when she said that, you know, about the gang member thing. Nah, I was, was like, are you, this guy is not part, in the Tracy, he's not one gang, he has never claimed a gang mm. in his life, I swear in any music mm-hmm. I've heard. Like, the guy, the guy does not, he just talks about, like, yeah. life, yeah, like, life girls, mm. and, Turning up. bruv, I don't even, even know what my man just doesn't talk about our anyone. Mm. So when she was saying that, I was like, ah. Oh. Now I see what your now, yeah, now yeah, I see what yeah. your lane is. What, what the mo is? I swear, talking about yeah, you have a lot of gang members in your video. Yeah, your mom's a gang member, you <laughs> fucking bitch, bro. Oh, that pissed me off, man. <laughs> no, she was even mad. Yeah, but yeah, on on the Atlanta topic, fam. This Twenty One Savage. What do you mean? That's got nothing to do with Atlanta. <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> you said new, oh, you mean a new topic? What's got to do? What's got to do with Atlanta? <laughs> What? Well, we, we, oh yeah, well, like, he's, he's a UK rapper now, apparently. Yeah? Apparently. Well, L.2.1, L- 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 <laughs> my jigger, thriller. <laughs> nah, fam, we're not, like... He's free now, by the way, on Yeah, bond. yeah, I saw it. he got um, free on bond. But yeah, all I saw in, in the group was Marco put plus 4-4 four, four Savage. I was like, what's, what's <laughs> going on, fam? <first?" laughs> 
I was like, what's going on? Hit Twitter, Twitter, like, I've never seen Twitter go that mad in, bro. like, firm. No, because it was, no, nah, no. Nah, it's cut. the amount of memes, like, it was just. Bro, it didn't make sense. Yeah, yeah, it didn't make sense at all. Like, when you I thought it was a lie. I was like, mm. bro, people need to get over, like, it's all, I was thinking it's not as deep, but bro, mm-hmm. like, no, 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 he English, bro. Yeah, not even Jermaine hit me up, said he's got the, the intel, bro. That's why I wish you. I wish you was hearing that man had the. In, the, the funny thing in, is, yeah, mm. that <laughs> there would have been people going around saying, "Bro, you know he's my cousin still." Twenty one seven is my cousin. People yeah, like, shut yeah. up. Shut no, up, shut that's up. what Jermaine said. He knows a guy who's like the uncle or something. But then, yeah, I think it's been going around because I saw it even. Bro, yeah, it's true. You know, people been talking about it. Yeah, yeah. So, so like S S P from um from what do you call it? Go what that group's called, but yeah, SP. He even said, "Ah, oh, like I don't know why Twenty One Savage acts like he's not from here." Uh-huh. Basically, yeah. but <laughs> yeah, even what's his name as well? Um, Caleb Dennis. Mm-mm-mm. His friend is that's his that's the cousin. Oh, cousin of Twenty One yeah, Savage. Yeah, like as soon as it happened, he was in his boy's yard, Snapchatting the pictures with him in it. The Flip family pictures. Him, oh, Twenty One. But like my, fi- I guess the the real question is: Does that take away from his music? Does that mean I don't know why people care? He's like, it any change, less real? Of course not. It don't change his music, mm. bro. He left at tw- he left England at twelve, bro. Mm, mm, mm. Bro, tell me what you were like at twelve. I know yeah. many people like, bro. Come on, that does not change anything. He's just interested. Mm, mm. The guy is as American as he was before. Yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying. He's not like he never faked any. He, to be fair, listen to his interviews. He actually never really said that he was born in Atlanta. He said he grew up in Atlanta. Yeah, yeah, that's true. And obviously, like, for people who are saying that, oh, why has he never said this? If he was there, basically, illegally, he's not going to be bro, talking about the situation. I'm not going to be like, <laughs> yeah, man. So so where you from? Let's say I'm legally in this country. Yeah, yeah. Hey, man, I'm from the Congo. <laughs> I'm from the Congo, man. Yeah, I'm in the Congo, yeah. And I moved here. Then Ice going to come and tell me, yo, I swear, you, sh- you meant to have gone, like, 20 yeah, years yeah, ago. Yeah, what yeah, are you doing yeah. here? Wrap, wrap you up quick time. And they'll, they'll, especially in America, with Ice fam, Ice, they look for to boot people oh, up. Oh, yeah. Especially now with Donald Trump's administration said, firm. Fuck Donald Trump. Yeah, they, let me not say that, in it? Because that's how I get mm. banned from US. <laughs> Big up Donald. Build that wall. <laughs> the, when, when you fly over here, they'll take you to one next room. I firm. swear. <laughs> yeah, this. So can, I have a, can we have a quick chat with you, please? He's coming to a room. Um, you, made a, you made a threat on your podcast. Is it called uh, Art Collection? Yes, yes. yes You're it's, banned. It's time to go back to England. <laughs> I swear, nigga. <laughs> but yeah, no, that was... When I saw that, like... My main thing is, yeah, nah, it's jokes, whatever, but that's a man's life. lost his freedom as well. Yeah. He's got kids. He could potentially get deported back to here, so. To be fair, you see what mm. Jay-Z did? He ain't going nowhere. Oh, yeah, yeah, Jay-Z bro. got paid for his lawyers and all of that. That's why they really, bro, that's why he got bond, fam. Mm. You don't get bond from flipping. In America, you don't get bond with um, like I assume, immigration. Yeah, 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 immigration. yeah, trust me, if that was any Tom, Dick and Harry film. Oh, they're gone. Finished. Do you know the worst prisons in America mm. are the, um, what's in the uh, deportation? Yeah, whatever yeah, no, nah, apparently they said there's bro, like rats and that. Bro, you spent 23 hours in your cell. Jeez. So how are you doing yeah. solitary? So it's mm. worse, it is worse for you, it's better for you, yeah, to go and commit triple homicide in America mm. than to be an illegal immigrant. Because at least in triple homicide, you go to jail, but mm. you're, you're going to be in, you're going to be on the wing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Bro, you're illegal immigrant. Twenty three hours on lockup. Rats, food is shit because they, you know they're, they're trying to boot you out. It's yeah, overcrowded. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. the idea is basically that um, when you're in that awkward, when you're in, uh, when you're detained, if you leave the country, because you're allowed yeah. to be like on the leave, if you leave the country, then you're never allowed to come back. Flipping up. So the idea is obviously um, you're meant to wait. You're meant to wait there for your court date. So yeah. if you wait for your court date, then you can challenge it, and then it's better for yeah. you. But obviously, twenty one can do that because mm. he's got the resources. However, bruv, if he's just uh, what's the name, Mohammed from down yeah, the road, yeah, that's got no people, no money. They they hold you there for three, four years, bruv, and you're eating once a day. You don't see sunlight for you only see sunlight for an hour. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm you be like, fuck, I'm going home, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then once you, they say, are you sure? Mm. Yeah, you go. You can't come back to the US. No. That's what they're trying to do to man, bro. I don't know how you did it, bruv. What what and what makes you laugh is the government don't realize they've made it. They just turned man into martyr. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Made him, him bigger now. Because when he when he comes on road and he drops a tree, oh, yeah, 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 you're right. Oh. You know, oh, I didn't even think about that. I was trying to get me. <laughs> His I last was album, to get me. Bang, I, was, I, was, I swear, I was playing it um, on the way here. Like I was trying to get me. Yeah, the whole album. Like he's a sick artist as well. So I think that's why. And like, I think he's the type of artist where like 
even though yeah he's from the UK, but his realness still resonates in it, Bro, basically. He, and I like the fact that mm. as well that he's kind of changed his. He's kind of like um, since he since he started dating um, since he what well, he dated and then um, Amber Rose, Amber Rose but yeah. he just he just like he switched, switched up, up his whole yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. The guy, bro, the guy literally doesn't wear chains anymore. Yeah, yeah. Because he said he said he said I was around bare rich people, and I realized I was the only nigga in the, in the room wearing chains. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I realized there's no point in wearing chains, so he stopped wearing chains. Um, like invest he invests bare P real estate yeah. like the guy actually because he clocks like raw like this is actually dumb like yeah yeah it is it is man because like, you deep it was gold the well the, the money that, doesn't I do, I do it, the chain. it doesn't gain value in it like oh, you, gold don't gold mm. don't gain no value but these guys will buy gold but um but yeah man that's what and obviously he then did that freestyle start mm. talking about ice do you not hear it no, no, so, which one was oh, this? So, so it was on like, um, I think like late night with someone, I can't remember mm. who it was. Oh, skiing, yeah, he yeah, did no, one, I heard about like that, this, yeah. Oh, something like And uh, apparently they came after him like swiftly after bro, three days later. He I think he, it's like a Jimmy Kimmel show. Yes, yeah, yeah. and he was like something like, oh, something about the borders. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They came. Next thing you know, three days later, boom. But apparently he wasn't, well, they said in it, he wasn't the- No, they say that. Nigga, they were trying to get, like, you're t- this, do you know this guy's been arrested like how many times? Oh, yeah, yeah. I know, and this guy's right. got a, he's got a, um, what do you call it? He's got a, what's the thing, what's it called? He's got a charge, like a proper, proper, yeah, yeah, proper yeah. charge. But it's not a felony, apparently. No, it's a felony. No, he had a felony. Mm. But it got expunged off his record. Oh, okay. But I see. As soon as he had the felony, mm. they meant to then check your status. Check your status. Oh, swear you're illegal. Boot. But they yeah. suddenly forgot back then because they didn't give a shit. Yeah. Because yeah. obviously, man was paying tax to the government. And mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Now he's. That's why uh, it shows you America's about money. Simple, like. Stupid country, bro. That's right. When you, when you got the, the money, you can finesse. Any how you like. Finesse the situation. But yeah, no, nah, he's on bond now. So he's, he's at home. Mm. Yeah. They even try to say, and the thing is, they they detain you. They're, they're not meant to detain you unless you're like a flight risk and everything's there. They yeah, try to yeah. argue the flight risk. Everyone's like, what the fuck? How can he be a, how can he be a flight risk yeah, yeah, when he's yeah, not yeah. trying to leave the country? I don't think since he's been there, he, I don't think he's. He's never done it. That's why he doesn't tour yeah, like yeah, that. That's yeah, why. Yeah. He, and if he does fly, it has to be like private charter jets. That's yeah, what he's yeah, been doing, yeah. isn't it? So in a, in the US like, as well. In a, I don't know if he, I don't know. Say he hasn't left the US, but like mm. in and about the, in and about the US kind of thing. Mm, 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 mm. But like more time, he's not. He, bro, he, he would have played in like England or something. Especially if you're yeah. from England. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah definitely yeah, yeah. would have gone England. You know what I'm saying? If I Fam, were, he would have been on wireless bro, easily. For him. But again, apparently though, was, not even apparently, he's mm. um, he obviously applied for like indefinite stay, mm. and they had it on, they had it pending for two years. Oh man! So like, that's the thing. I don't believe he knows the situation, so he wouldn't have just left, bro, especially now that he's on in the. Bro, he would have been like, yeah. he would have been trying. Yeah, been trying, yeah, trying. Yeah. That's why he told all his family, like, look, bro, you need to relax. We're saying I'm from England, kind of yeah, thing. Yeah. Except if you heard his mum's accent. Yeah, but she's just from you. Yeah, she's from you. Yeah, yeah, she's good. <laughs> ah, she should never. Honestly, she should have not spoken, fam. That was ridiculous. But the thing is, she's had like she's got better English. She's got better English accent than my mum, bro. <laughs> what the fuck, man? No, but the, like he's taken her to the Grammys, like. Yeah, of course, that's your budget, it's not really a tip. No, but that's what I'm saying, so it's not like he tried to hide the fact that. Yeah, but like people anything. just think he was born here, mm. and she just moved here, he was born. Mm. But obviously, she was in Newham. Newham, fam, what? Funny thing is, yeah, do you know what that says though? Mm. He's the greatest British artist, b- British rapper of all time. You know what I'm saying? He's the greatest British artist of all time. <laughs> Are you saying he's better than DWE? Is that what you're saying? No, no, I said he's sold more than any British artist, British rapper, no, you know, ever. Yeah, sold more. Yeah, nah, that's probably true. <laughs> that's I swear the guy's even picked up a, a cheeky Grammy here or something. Yeah, that one's them, them, he's been on a song or something. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nah, I'm, I think he was not. He's been nominated. How I many... think he would have been not because his mum, yeah. So like some madness happened with the Grammy as well. His like he obviously couldn't go, but then oh. his mum was supposed to get a ticket. But then they were holding the ticket for ages, isn't it? So his team called that out on Twitter, and then like obviously when the Grammy saw that, they were like, "Oh, we don't want any issues," and then they patterned it up, innit? But like they started moving funny, innit? Obviously when they see, oh, like. No, because it would have been ice giving them pressure. Like, bro, yeah, you, yeah, be, you yeah. better not be. They bet like, f- give them as much stress as possible, mm. so that they just want to bounce out of the country, which doesn't yeah, yeah. fucking make sense because they built their life here. Yeah, 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 yeah. But funny thing is, they can't even touch his peas though. Mm. They can't touch his peas. So the guy, got, the guy will always be caked. But yeah, no, nah, they shouldn't be able to. Man, he's made that, fair, that money. He's made off the rep. As soon as he mm. like, obviously, it's all patterned and he gets his definite stake. He's gonna come to the UK and kill it. 
Oh, he's gonna do one show. Everyone's gonna go nuts. So, you're right though. You know what? Even though it's it's bad press, but they have that saying: all press is good. Press. Bro, it's good for him. In the end. And like, even like, think like These the BBC are... was talking about him before. Like, <laughs> do you know that? They yeah, they said it. It's, um, a rapper from America called Savage Twenty One. <laughs> Savage Twenty One. <laughs> he's apparently from New York. S Twenty One. S Twenty One. Twenty one seconds to go. Twenty one seconds to go. <laughs> so sorry. But yeah, um, he, but the thing is, yeah, that's what these Americans, they don't, like, American establishment, they don't realise. When mm. you do these to these rap artists, yeah, mm. they've now got enough clout and capital to challenge these things, bruv. They will just come out as martyrs. Mm. Look at Meat Mill. Meat Mill is the, oh, yeah, the modern day yeah. Tupac now because they went and did uh, X, Y, and Z yeah, to yeah, him yeah, because yeah. he was doing Willie's. Let him out. They put him in jail for how many, was, was that, how many years was it? Fam, they didn't, they, he's, but like, he's on probation for like 16 years or something. Yeah. <laughs> so basically, like, it's like, there's so many things you can do to mess up in that time, in especially probation. Yeah. when you're a rapper, innit? You're doing mad even stuff. Even then, like, mm. if you ever caught around someone with a gun, yeah, you, yeah, can, yeah, you can be your probation, you're not meant to. So it's, it's basically like you're set up to fail. Bro, the probation mm. make, does not make sense in America. And you have to, oh, yeah, you, you know, you have mm. to pay your probation officer in America. You have to pay them. You have to pay your probation officer. So, think, so this is how it works in America. This is how stupid it is. You have to pay your probation officer. Mm. Yeah. And then. Uh, if you don't pay, you're, you're going to jail. Mm. You need to get a job, obviously, to pay your probation officer. Yeah. But you can't get a job because you're a felon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So obviously, you, you're then going to jail because you can't get a job. Yeah. If you're, if you're, um, what else is it? I can't even remember. Obviously, it, you can't, you f it's difficult for you to travel as well. You can't travel because you're a felon. Cause you're yeah. a felon. You can't own a gun because you're a felon. You can't work in certain places because you're a felon. Like, it doesn't make sense. But then they say, yeah. but it only works for rappers. Yeah, yeah. Rappers, kind of. it's how they keep people in the cycle, but mm. that's another, that's another. Well, yeah, but big yeah, up 21, anyway. Savage 21. Yeah, yeah he's, free, he, he's free now, so. Free my guy, free at last, free at last. <laughs> my God, he's free at last. That's it, nice. No, what are you, you saying is there? Fam, I think we did like, I, I can't lie, so I watched them Filthy Fellas yesterday. So oh, that's Savage Dance oh, thing. Fam, that was sad. Yeah, they did a the tribute for Cadet. Like, R.I.P. Like, Cadet, big man thing, big man thing. Yeah. Now, when I, you know what? For me, what's so mad about it is like, this is like, f like this is like the golden age of UK music, in my opinion. And like, you could always see he's been. <laughs> nah, so before we get into this, we need to. We're gonna pour up. We're gonna pour up in it, little yeah, piece yeah, for, yeah. for 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 cadet still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come, come, come. Yeah, come. pour a little piece. Oh man, fuck. That hobo juice. Pass some of that ginger beer as well. Oh, well, so they can. No, they'll just chop this out. Yeah, they are. Yeah, it's not that deep. It'll just be like, just fade in and out. No, it's it's seven twenty at the moment anyway. Okay, so we'll just work out quickly. Yeah, we'll just do it with this and then get like ten minutes out of it and then we good. But yeah, what yeah, what are you saying? What are you saying? Yeah, no, I was just saying, yeah, so like in my opinion, this is the, the golden age of UK urban music and Bruv. with Cadet you'd always see him working, working, working. And like now with the advice song of Dino you know, the Riz, it was like it was finally getting Chart success, he was built to perform at wireless. He was moving in it. Yeah. And it's like it's just mad when someone in their prime is just taken and it's like And the guy always gave out mm. good energy. That's yeah, what yeah, I liked yeah. about Cadet. Like Every, everywhere like people are speaking about him, it's like ah oh, I, I met energy, this guy. Bruv. Like it felt like I'd known him for years. I only just met him but and yeah, it's like it is that cliche saying the good that young. Yeah, like, it's, it's, and the things about him is like he or someone which people what what people liked about that like, he was so authentic like mm. everything he like he was just bare open about like you know what I'm saying about everything he was going through, bro. I've never heard someone talk about so many different like situations in their life the way my man would do it and it's like that's what kind of made him like a good art, like a great artist. Yeah, and it's just like I saw it because I just I, I remember like I woke up like mad early, mm -hmm. like, mad early, and then uh, I saw on Twitter someone was like. I think something like, like it wasn't like R.I.P. Cadet, but it was something along yeah. the lines of like, 
Something that made me basically like you know search on Twitter, oh, yeah, yeah. connecting it, and I just see yeah that he had a like car crash. And I'm really like like raw, like for, like a car crash. Like, yeah, would yeah, you, like, yeah. What, like what do you mean in it? And obviously then people start coming out, and obviously you see more people waking up on Twitter, waking yeah, up, waking yeah. up, waking up because you can see more tweets. And it's just mad sad because I never thought he got the recognition he deserved while he was like alive. But he I thought slow, like, he was slowly getting But I thought this year was like yeah. Cause I can't lie, like, um, mm. like, like for example, I didn't really like the advice song, but that's not really my kind of song. Yeah. But what he was doing, I was like, that's fucking sick. Oh yeah, yeah. You know what yeah. I'm saying, like, bro, like he finally broke. Like, there's a funny um, story. Like, Krep told him when Krep was performing at oh, Wireless, wireless. Yeah, this yeah, could yeah. be you if you work hard. Yeah. That would have been him. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm he saying was supposed to perform because he was supposed to perform, and he would have. That was like that him and Dino. That would have been. Oh yeah, yeah. That yeah, was yeah, that yeah. was that would have been me one of the biggest songs at Wireless. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah. And it's like, someone like him, yeah, it's just mad sad because I feel like he finally got what he was, you know what I'm saying? He was what finally he getting what for, he yeah, worked yeah, for. for after, after orders, yeah. But like, main thing I would like, like I would tell people is like, look, yeah, make sure you do something that you actually enjoy doing in life. Because mm. at least with him, yeah. we can say that he, I am saying like, he passed, but he was doing what he loved, didn't it? Yeah, he was yeah, going exactly. on his way to a show, in it? Like, he was exactly. doing what he was loved. I'm not saying this. I'm not saying it's any situation that's yeah. good for you to pass. But that's the silver lining. But that's the silver lining. Yeah. The guy was, you know what I'm saying? He wasn't doing anything bad on road. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? He he had con- reconnected with his cousin. They had done everything. He was, you know, ready to kill it. Yeah. And then obviously, you know, what happened happened. And it's just sad because I feel really like, he's just a nice guy, man. Yeah. And off the back of what you were saying, it's like, I know death is a difficult topic, you know, but it's just like, it makes you think, man was only 28, like, you, you never know Damn. when it's your time, innit? Damn. So, like, your loved ones always, mm. like, I know sometimes you might be pissed at your mom or pissed at your dad or, like, whatever. But it's not worth but, it. Yeah, like, you've always got to think, like, of the bigger picture, like, you never know when it's your time, basically, yeah. so you just got to show love. And the thing is, can. like, with, with him and, like, what's the first, okay, what's the first song you heard of him? You heard from him? <sighs> I feel like he had um, a Link Up TV freestyle. What, um, like when it was behind bars or? Yeah, yeah. I think it was over a Drake beat. But yeah, that was, that was, uh, that was cold. That was cold. For me, my first one was, you know, Slut. Is that what he's talking about? he's talking about, about like his, um, his goal or something? Rav. Yeah, yeah, that's when I heard him, and I was like, "This is Bro, mad." The situations he's been through, are just and the thing is, that's, 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 level. and the thing is, yeah, what I loved mm. about the guy was like the situations he went through. They were meant, but like the guy was still like he was chatting about it. You know what oh saying? yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the guy went through jump. Yeah, yeah. most man will be too too. Bro, too what he has gone through, like most man cannot last through. Mm. I tell you that for free, just from the music I've heard, gone through and talked about it as Bro, well. The guy, <laughs> so the guy dropped slut, then yeah. he dropped um. There's another freestyle about, oh, even when he was talking about um, a when one girl lied about who, that the U was here. Oh, yeah, like yeah, yeah. And there was another thing, then Crept. And I was like, right, yeah, this guy. letters to Crept as well. Do you know what I mean? Paul puts his heart on his sleeve. And what I liked about him mm-hmm. as well, like people would always banter him about, about it and that. Yeah. Yeah, and he never took it to heart. Yeah, yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? He was just like, this is, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He enjoyed life. And that's what I, like, I liked about him from, I didn't really know him. Like I didn't know him, mm. but I'm saying, but. You can that's, just feel the energy. Feel the energy. And that's what it yeah. says a lot about a person. That's why I always yeah. say, be like, your marking life should be a thing where yeah. people might not know you, yeah. but they feel good energy from you anyway. Yeah, yeah, and they yeah. feel like, yeah, you're the, you're a good guy. No, but it's sad though. I know, and you it's never. It's so fucking sad. You, you never want your last thing to be like, oh, I didn't really rate that man, or like, oh, yeah, like, I, mean, I got Bro, how many artists, like, guy. it's sad, yeah, but how many artists have passed, yeah, and, and had this kind of reaction? It's like man, they don't really n- people just near to none basically. Normally, when artists pass, they've done some madness. Like, yeah, yeah. Bro, look at like when you even watch the Fufu Fellas episode. Like mm. that man, were f- they were touched. Oh yeah, they yeah, were touched. Yeah, That's yeah. the first time I've seen Spets Gonzalez being like serious. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, like they were touched, and it's thing is, it says a lot about a person. You know what I mean? Spets would even like interview them, and you could see like they had the because he's a cool guy, bro. Like man, yeah. just like. It's calm in life just to be cool, in it? Like, mm. just, just be a cool guy. Like, man had no bravado about him. Man wasn't really, I mean, he wasn't a dickhead. You know what it is, basically, in, in a nutshell, in, in a nutshell, he's himself, in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, a lot of people put up a front because they're 
too afraid of what people we think, think about them yeah, yeah, yeah. or like oh I've got to be this hard guy hard I can't guy show any emotion this and that. anything like that but like as we said in it he put his heart on his sleeve he talked about his life in depth without fear of what people think about him and like he made music that touched people's souls. Like you can even see from all the like listeners' reactions, like people are really feeling it. And I think because I can't remember this really happening where like an artist was taken in his prime in the UK the of UK. recent. Like, and I think more times they are, they're gone jail. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying, like let's say Crazy Titch for example. Yeah, yeah. When he's yeah. in jail, but or mover, but like this guy actually, you he know what I'm saying, taken he, and he was taken, funny. and it's sad, yeah. man. But like I would tell people, like you need to, like I don't like to use things like this as lessons in it because mm. I think it's rude in it. But I would tell people like you need to make sure that the stamp you leave on life mm. is a thing that people be like, yeah, you know what? Like I had time for this guy. Like I fucked yeah, with this yeah. guy. Look at the people that turn up to his memorial. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Man, that looked like it's back. nuts, yeah. man. And it's like, nah, man. I just hope that everyone in his family are like, you know, yeah, as, that's the main thing. Cause they're we, as good as they can be. We we even forget like. There's the people who don't know him, then yeah, there's the people in the scene who him. kind of know him. Then there's his mom, but then there's, there's his actual family. family, like that's actually. How you get like, a call at three in the morning saying yeah. this happened? You know what I'm saying? Fam, I was shocked when I heard bro. It. I was, sp- I'm lying to you in it. I'll be honest. I was so spun. I was spun for bare long. I was like, wait, 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 wait. I was thinking, nah, this <laughs> can't be real at first. I was like, I'm a cadet. Mm. That could be like, like, like I'm not say people die every day, you know, mm. but like, it happens on the TL, like you'd be like, yeah. raw, mad thing. You know what I'm saying? Even like when, let's say, Shoki passed or something like, something like that. Yeah. I was like, he's mad. I feel bad, but I was like, you know, like, it happens, innit? Yeah, yeah, But this one, I was like, Whoa. bro, I was like, raw. Even when I'm talking to people, you know what I'm saying? The only people that, like, I was, I would, like, I was linking up that day or the next day, they will be like, yo, yo, Jan, you hear about, you put yeah, about cadet? Cadet, yeah, you hear about yeah, cadet? Yeah, 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 My group chat, cadet, I'm like, raw. And a lot of people are saying the same thing, like, raw, it's not good, it's not right, man, but. Yeah. Like, like I said, in it, just make sure in life you're doing what you want to do, mm. and you're leaving a, a positive mark. Like, the mark okay, or a mark you want to leave on the, like on the world, didn't it? Because out of anything, yeah, I'll tell you, you'll be proud of the mark he's left in it. Because not a lot of artists have the whole of the UK yeah, yeah, their same way. No. Deep it, everybody was sad. Yeah, 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 look at like gigs. Remember he was beefing crept. Yeah, man, just messed him straight away. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, like. People that have met him once, people that ain't met him are, oh, nah, man. R.I.P. Um, cadet, innit? Yeah. R.I.P. Uh, uh, Rest in uh, power, car. R.I.P. to my guy, like, mm. you're in a better place now. Big man thing. And, like, I hope your, fa- like, the family just stays strong, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically. Because, bruv, it's sad, but, <sighs> yeah. man, what can you do? Should we wrap it up there, then? Yeah, we'll leave it there, we'll leave it there. Boom, boom. AC Podcast, our first SoundCloud edition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hope Audio and that. We're, yeah, yeah, we're yeah. expanding. Hope, they say we're trying, like exactly. We're trying, trying. Uh, real quick before we leave, uh, big up Jermaine and the new kid. Should be born by the time this comes out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Fingers crossed. Fingers that's the first crossed. AC child. Then Denzel will have the next AC child. <laughs> and I say, God willing. You know what I'm saying? God, <laughs> um, we know, Denzel, we know you're trying, innit? Nah, well, nah, 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 God bless nah, you. Nah, <laughs> man's, man's living in this. Big up everyone. Pap. In Jesus' path. In Jesus' path. But uh, that and then uh, AC uh, Art Collection, Peckham Levels, yeah. 21st? 21st, yeah. 21st. Yeah, yeah. Next Thursday. Oh, my even getting involved. <laughs> 21st. <laughs> so 21st of February. It should be out. It should be out before then. Yeah, 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 yeah. 21st of February, come through. Come meet the man them. I'm spinning. We've got Armour coming through as well. Oh, yeah. Um, and Ludo. Ludo. Ezzy. 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 Yeah. yeah, so it should be a mad thing. And I think it's anything else. No, anything else. So, yeah. yeah. Boom, boom. Follow us on the socials as well. Boom, bam, bam. Yeah, yeah. Do the one. Oh, yeah. Peace out. Bitches. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>